Welcome to our Rejects tutorial. Today, we're tackling a fascinating question from one of our viewers. They want to know how to use Rejects to find if they've used the same character as a delimiter in multiple locations within a series of numbers. Let's dive into the specifics of their challenge. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your questions, answering them, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you'll find that solution you're looking for. Now, let's continue on to the video. To find numbers with the same delimiter using rejects, we need to create a pattern that captures this requirement. Let's start by understanding the structure of the numbers you provided. Your current rejects pattern is too broad. It allows for different delimiters between the number groups. Instead, we need a way to ensure that the same delimiter is used consistently. To achieve this, we can use a capturing group to remember the first delimiter and then reference it later in the pattern. This way, we ensure that the same delimiter is used throughout. Now, let's break down the updated regex. The parentheses create a capturing group for the delimiter, and slash one ensures that the same delimiter is used in both places. Finally, let's test this regex with your examples. The updated pattern will match 123 plus 456 plus 7890. 123456-7890 and 123.456-7890, but it will fail for 123 as expected. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To find if you've used the same character in different locations, you can use a back reference in your regex. For example, the pattern Datern Thrint plus Dats Raytrin test out in tab 4 captures the first operator and ensures it's the same in subsequent locations. The first part of the rejects captures the operator, and the one back reference checks for its repetition. This way, you can confirm that the same character appears in multiple places. For more examples and to practice, check out the Regex 101 demo linked in the description. You can also learn more about back references on the regularexpressions.info website. And that's it guys. I hope this video helped find that resolution you're looking for and you found the answer. Guys, please hit subscribe if it helped and I'd really appreciate it. I'll see you next time on another one of these technical videos. Have a good one.